It's a man who wielded it meant to cut your throat, but your mother fought him off. The other dagger, the one that took her life. I would have stopped that dagger with my own heart if I could have. I wasn't there for her when she needed me most. But I am here for her now. To do what she would have done. To protect her children. Anything I can do for you, Brandon. You need only ask. Do you know who this belonged to? No. That very question was what started the War of the Five Kings. In a way, that dagger made you what you are today. Forced from your home, driven out to the wilds beyond the wall. I imagine you've seen things most men wouldn't believe. To go through all of that and make your way home again only to find such chaos in the world. I can only imagine. Chaos is a ladder. <laughs> I'm sorry to have disturbed you, Lord Stark. I'm not Lord Stark. Mr. Welkin built it for me, so I can move around more easily. It's a very good idea. You're leaving? I don't want to leave you, but when... when they come, I need to be with my family. And you're safe. You're as safe as anyone can be now. And you don't need me anymore. No, I don't. That's all you've got to say. Thank you. Thank you. For helping me. My brother died for you. Hodor and Summer died for you. I almost died for you. Brian. I'm not really. Not anymore. I remember what it felt like to be Brandon Stark. But I remember so much else now. You died in that cave. <laughs>